guys, it's Clara. Welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Bath and Body Works haul to show you. I'm laughing because I'm looking at all this stuff and thinking, yes, I succumbed to the craziness. As you may know, they are having their semi-annual sale. It is going on, I think, for a few weeks. So it is so bad because, I mean, you can like something and then go back for a little bit more and um, yeah so um, I'm also laughing because I had intended not to go at all of course um, but you know I took a look online and I had specifically been waiting for them to come back with the signature vanilla coconut and I have a friend that works there she had done some of the research for me and they don't make that anymore they only have that in the body spray I was kind of hoping that if they did have it, maybe they would have it for like two or three dollars, you know, as stuff that they're discontinuing, but of course they don't. You know, they might have the lemon or some other kinds of the signature vanillas, but I cannot find the coconut vanilla. And when I do find it, I'm going to buy like 20 of them. I don't even freaking care because I have not been able to find a coconut like that in forever. So, um, yes, so I did go online. There is one more scent that I like, and I know they have so many different kinds of scents. The scent is called Midnight Pomegranate. And this specifically evokes memories of Vegas for me, and Vegas holds a lot of lovely romantic memories with my husband. They were like $2.75 each. So I ended up buying eight of the Midnight Pomegranate lotions. And I love, love this scent. I can't believe that they're discontinuing it. I'm so sad. And then I ended up buying one of their Midnight Pomegranate shower gels. And if that were not bad enough, when I went to my eye appointment yesterday, I ended up going again because they have one of their stores right next to my eye appointment so yes again i know i know these were 350 each and this is the boardwalk vanilla cone deep cleansing hand soap they also had the foaming soaps as well mm, and these are just so incredible it's almost like you could eat them they smell so delicious this was also 350 this is perfect beach day and this has a very citrusy kind of scent uh, it says watery melon young coconut and sparkling bergamot is that how you say that i don't know um but yes Mm, it just smells so amazing. Love, love the citrusy scents to really kind of wake you up, especially in the kitchen too, because it really makes me feel like my hands are clean. So this time though, I decided to try a new scent. Um, I am very, very picky about scents and um, I know that there's so much goodness at Bath and Body Works, but this one is totally different than the Midnight Prom Granite and different from the Coconut Vanilla. This is the Eucalyptus Spearmint. I was really hoping to get the aromatherapy line for the Eucalyptus Spearmint because I think that smells better than this. It reminds me of after getting a massage and then they put the peppermint oil on you and then they have the eucalyptus essential oils but I'm hoping that when I put this on it'll still evoke those same kinds of memories. I bought the body sprays also in the eucalyptus spearmint. Oh gosh I went back yes I did yes I did so I discovered that that eucalyptus spearmint was way too strong for me and it wasn't as minty as I thought it would be so I ended up going back and exchanging it for some other items. So I was looking online, just to look online, and they had said that their aromatherapy line was going on sale as well. Went to the store, hoping it would be also in store that they would have the sale, and they did. I got the aromatherapy one, the one that I liked originally. These were $5 each, so I'm gonna give this one a try. Also, the orange ginger. This is very, very, energizing as it says it wakes you up in the morning very nice to have also the eucalyptus tea and the sleep one in lavender chamomile I also realized I had received a gift from somebody and I didn't really like 
um, the body mist spray they had sent me. So I went ahead and exchanged it for a cucumber melon. And uh, this one brings back memories of high school, totally. Okay, so I think that is it. No more going to Bath and Body Works. I am just totally avoiding them. I know that they give you coupons and stuff that is valid starting July 6th. But luckily, it's a coupon where you actually have to spend money in order to get something back. Uh, if it was a coupon where you just automatically get a free item without a purchase, then I might be more inclined to actually spend money. So uh, thankfully, it's not one of those. And I can stay out of BBW for a while. Hopefully, hopefully, hopefully. Let me know what scents you really like that you picked up during this crazy semi-annual sale. I know not every scent is for everybody, which is why they have 10 billion kinds of scents. So I love learning how different people like different kinds of scents. It kind of tells you a little bit more about them. That is it for this Bath & Body Works haul. Thank you so much for watching, guys. Take care.